guys, me host Super Sorrow. Thank you very much for tuning in. Look what I got. I got some packages. <laughs> I got some stuff to open, guys, and show you guys what's coming up on the channel. I'm so excited. These look awesome. So both these items have come from Comics and Cocktails. Bud Wade. Dash more. I forgot about these ones over here for a second then. Can I lift this without breaking it? Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, uh, it's all on the floor. God damn it. Oddly shaped items don't stack. Ah, right, I'm ready. So we have a bunch of stuff, uh, most of it from comics and cocktails to be fair. A couple of other things that I've picked up this week as well, including Guardians of the Galaxy for the Xbox. I will be playing this on stream on my channel very soon. Yes, I will. I'm going to play this on stream, guys, so it's going to be a lot of fun. So tune in for that. I'm very excited to have this, actually. It's been... A long time coming that game, so I'm actually really excited to play it. So yeah, we have the Guardians of the Galaxy, brand new video game. Then in preparations for going to see the Eternals at the cinema, obviously Marvel Select Comics have released an Eternals graphic novel. This is reprintings of Eternal from the 2021 series, numbers 1 through 6, and is a part of the Panini Magazine's collection and came out on the 14th of October. So I'm going to give this a read as it might give me a little bit of insight into the Eternals. They're not something that I've been overly familiar with in my time. Um, I was, I've was i always been more of an X-Men reader. Um, not really been big on the Avengers and stuff like that. And I've not really paid much attention to the cosmic side of Marvel, to be honest, for a long time. So I'm not sure how long the Eternals have been around, so I need to have a good read and uh, learn a little bit more before the movie. Just pop that over there behind me. So from Comics and Cocktails, I did have a couple of packages earlier this week. I thought I'd include them in this haul as well, which I've already opened, which includes Marvel's Sandman, so I'm very happy to have a Sandman finally. I've been needing a Sandman in my Spider-Man collection for some time, so it's awesome to finally have him in the collection, especially on this awesome card back. So yes, we finally have a, uh, a Sandman. I think, I think now I officially have all of the Sinister Six. Pretty sure. And then I couldn't resist grabbing Tigra. She's been, a, been one that I've been after for some time since she was announced. It's such a cool character and something a little bit different. She looks absolutely awesome as well on this card back. So very awesome. I'm loving the face sculpts as well they've given her. I just can't wait to bust her out and give her a full review. So full review of that coming real soon on the channel, guys. Wow. All right, onto the big boxes. Let's start with this one. So as I say, all these have come from Comics and Cocktails, and I've paid for all these. Uh, there's no freebies in today's haul. Everything here I've pre-ordered and paid for myself. I always like to tell you, obviously, it's, it's, it's only right that I tell you if I've, if I've paid for it or not. Ugh. So these are all things that I have paid for. These are all things I've chosen to buy with my own money. Here we go. Oh, yes. I've been dying to get these for so long. I have I've gone I've gone it upside down here as well. I've got the box upside down. I've just realized. Because they're all upside down. So we have Oh yes. We have Marvel Sylvie from Loki. Very cool. We have the What If series including T'Challa Star Lord. The zombie Captain America. I may have to do a quick review of that, you know, over Halloween. That might have to be a Halloween review. We have Zombie Hunter Spider Man. And I can't wait to try out the Tom Holland head on that one and see how that looks, you know. Oh, yeah. We have Heist Nebula. The one that I've been most excited for, which is Doctor Strange Supreme. And of course, we can build the, the Watcher Bath figure as well. And the figure that I think everybody was the most excited to get, Captain Carter. Yes, very excited to review this wave. I think I definitely need to build the Watcher and review him. 
And um, I 100% am going to have to do the Marvel Zombies Captain America. I'm going to have to do him over Halloween, guys, I think. It's done only right to review that figure before the end of Halloween. So, yes, an awesome wave there. Very happy to have that in my hands, finally, after all this time. If you'd like to see me do the zombie cap over Halloween, let me know. All right, and on to the big box. What's in here? Exciting times, people. What else we got? I honestly say that as I pre-order so much, I genuinely don't know what's in this box. Ooh, bro, I've just seen a little, little, little sneaky sneaky as to what's in this box. Exciting times. Right. Well, there's several little packages. Okay, so the first little bundle I'm grabbing. We finally have to the rest of the Mirrorverse series. Oh, the box is battered to hell, but luckily I'm an unboxer anyway, so that's no problem. Uh, but we have Goofy. So we finally have Goofy. He is a ranged character in the new Disney Mirrorverse game, according to this. So very happy to have him. We also have Disney's Mirrorverse Bell. As you guys know, I've already reviewed Bell at this point. So this is a Bell that I have to sell. Same with the Mickey. You guys already know that I already, I was a little bit impatient. Uh, for the pre-orders to come in and I grabbed myself an extra Mickey earlier in the year so I've got this Mickey as well up for that I'll be able to part with if anybody wants to take them off my hands but the last one in the collection that I needed it's Sully very cool to have him in that he is a tank very cool like a, like a weird smell coming off the uh, bubble wrap then I don't know what that was Oh yeah, look what we got! Another wave of figures. We have another whole wave here guys. You can clearly see from the side what these are. Need to get into the... Oops, banging everywhere. Removable wrap. Put bubble wrap in box. Put box on floor. Right. Move mirror reverse. Mirror reverse over here. Ugh. Always like Christmas. Yeah. Right. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. So we have the new Ghostbusters series, including Venkman. Zedemore. Ray Stance. And then we have the three new kids, including Trevor, Podcast, and Lucky. And I believe we are getting Phoebe later on. I believe she's coming as a like a, uh, a uh, like a exclusive character, I think, later on in the series. So that means we'll be able to build the Sentinel Terror Dog. Very cool. Wow. That is one heck of a haul. All that goodies. <laughs> Just lining them all up looks really cool. Wow. All that stuff, guys. That's an insane haul, right? How cool is that? <laughs> So guys, what are you excited to see the most on the channel? I know I've got Guardians of the Galaxy of the game as well, don't forget. Along with all of these figures to come on reviews. So stick around to the channel, it's going to be a lot of fun. Guys, what, what do you want to see first? Let me know in the comments below. As always guys, I'm your host Super and I'll see you in the next video. But until then, may the force be with you. Bye!